Coin, stranger? The doors of Mar closed off. Old Tegra can give you a discount. Fine weapon and arms. Dwarven made. At the point, we could all be figments of someone else's imagination. Just good to see you again. Play. Exactly. You, I, am. I shall do it. There she is. I'm gonna go talk to her. Look, you gotta back me up here. Got it? <laughs> Thanks, Warden. Just be ready to pry her off when she throws herself at me. We don't want to make a scene here. Well, don't pry her off me too soon. I mean, a little scene's all right. Are you sure you're not a baker? Because you got a sodding nice set of buns. Akron, is that you? Yeah, in the flesh, baby. What are you doing here? Uh, just trying to kick back with a pint. Fighting Darkspawn's a lot of sodding work, you know? You're fighting Darkspawn? Well, someone's gotta do it, you know? <laughs> Can't leave a blight to the humans. They'll just muck it all up. The whole surface to choose from, and you just happen to come to my tavern? Eh, uh, well... Uh... What? Oh, right. It's fate, Felsey. What can I say? Fate? The ancestors must have a sense of humor, then. Sure they do. <laughs> You've had a good look at Lady Helmy, haven't you? If her face isn't a joke the ancestors are playing, I'm a Brontos behind. So, Lady Helmy must be a paragon of beauty, then. I've been thinking about you, Felsey. What do you want, Ogryn? Nothing. Just thought I'd see how you were doing is all. Well, maybe that and grease up the Bronto, if you know what I mean. <laughs> well, you've seen me. You'll have to go back to Orzammar for the Bronto. Oh, the Queen needed a new fool, did she? Oh well, it's been fun, Felsi. But I better go. Wait, you're leaving? You just got here. I haven't called you a shaft rat yet. Well, you can't keep the archdemon waiting. You hurt its feelings and might just turn the whole blight around and go home. Nobody wants that. Well, you don't need to fight it right now, do you? I mean, you could have a pint first. You could call me a surly Bronto. <laughs> I could tell you that you smell like nut droppings. I'll tell you what, I got some things I gotta do, but I'll come back for that pint when things are settled. You frigid deep stalker. Fine, but you better not keep me waiting, you worthless copper plated sword cast. Wouldn't dream of it.
<laughs> I still got it. Weren't you watching? She could barely restrain herself. Might as well rest up while I can. You ready to go? Aye. All right then. Off. I was here first. What's it to you? I wasn't bothering nobody, and I was here first. Why, you looking to buy one? Oh, is he? Uh, well, that's... Uh, see, I'd like to sell you one, but I don't uh, have any myself. I got part of a glove. The wolves didn't chew too badly, though. I think it was a glove, anyway. I know, don't say it. I got cheated. I knew the guy who was here before me. He sold me this spot. Said he found giants and all kind of crazy valuables. He didn't mention that he'd taken everything but the bones and the dirt already. His name's Ferrin. Squirrely little bastard, if you ask me. Which you didn't, but I said it anyway. So he says. He didn't leave none of it here, I'll tell you. He was going to Orzammar, he said. I imagine he's gotten there by now. If you find him, tell him I sent you. It'll scare the piss out of him. Ah. As you say.
So, uh, you're back, I see. What can I do for you? You've, uh, heard of me? Where is my sword? I, uh, I don't know what you mean, sir. I, I don't have it. I swear by Andraste's knickers. I sold it on the way here. I sold it to a dwarf in Redcliffe, name of Dwin. I'm not, I promise you. We'll see. And after much sweat, blood and toil, her labors ended, and the world marveled at what she wrought. It shall be done. Make us blessings upon you, Warden. celebrate or whatever you have to do. Now, why would you be interested in that? It's mine. <sighs> you know, Farron didn't mention the giant he took it from was alive. Six sovereigns. That wasn't so hard, was it? It's in my strong box. Here's the key. Now, why don't you leave me alone? It is begun. Unexpected. Thank you. Strange. I had almost forgotten it. Completion. Are you sure you are a Grey Warden? I think you must be an Ashkari to find a single lost blade in a country at war. I will return to the Arishok with my report. But it would be a much more thorough and satisfying answer to his question if the blight were ended first. Don't you agree? Then lead the way.
Yes. Indeed. Yes. We've been waiting for you, Warden. be done. Why do you refer to me as the Elder Mage? Clearly, because it is purple, and a hyena. Then you simply wish to be perverse? Surely you're better than that. I have... You did it, Outsider. You saved us from the ravages of the curse, after all. May the Creators bless you, truly. But Zathrian is lost to us, after all these centuries. He died heroically, I hope. Some things are better left unsaid, I gather. His will still be a tale worthy of telling Dalish children for many years to come. Now, Keeper Lanaya prepares for us to enter into war alongside the humans. I never thought I'd live to see the day. I, for one, look forward to fighting against these darkspawn creatures. Do you now? Let's hope you return and tell us all about them. As for you, outsider, I expect I'll be telling tales about the Grey Warden one day, hmm? And they're a Natitian, Grey Warden. Join us at the fire if you like, but haven't you got a war to get to? I... I appreciate you trying to find him, but what are the chances? Anaren the healer? You know Anaren? He... he lives? No, it can't be him. Perhaps it is a common elven name. No, I know of only one Anaren. Ah, it makes sense. Anaren said that he was from the human cities. You are old friends, then. If you seek Anaren, you must venture into the forest. He prefers to be amidst the trees and the animals. Thank you all so much. Darth Shirol.
are the Grey Warden who broke the curse. I demand to know what happened to the werewolves. Where did they go? You did? And somehow, I believe you. That you took action against those murderers speaks well of you. Take this token. It was crafted long ago by a great master. Now I will go into the forest and hunt. Perhaps there are others still to be found, stragglers. I can only hope. You are not welcome here. Doing the Templars dirty work for them, eh? Templars or mages, it means nothing to us. There is dark power here. And you won't stand in our way. Shall be done. Friends, turn back, please. These woods are a danger to those who do not know the paths. A Niren? Wait, I. I remember your face, but younger, more impulsive, stern. Win? I thought they had killed you. They very nearly did. The Templars found me while I was searching for the Dalish. They ran me through and left me for dead. I brought this on you. Oh, I was a dreadful mentor, harsh and impatient. I, I am sorry for the way I treated you. I've put that behind me, and you should too. I didn't fit in with the Templars in your Chantry. My path lay elsewhere. Irving is a reasonable man. He will find some way for you to return. The Circle needs new blood. It needs to change. I have fond memories of Irving. He was always kind to me. I will consider your proposal, and perhaps I will speak with Irving. However, I promise nothing. Now, it is getting late and you have much to do. You should be on your way. No, we've spent enough time on my personal affairs. It is time for us to move on. Look at this. It's the hardened sap of a tree native to this forest. It's been something of a lucky charm for me. And now I want you to have it. Very well. I'm grateful. 
May your gods smile on you and Aaron. And on you. Thank you so much. Yes, you led me to an Aaron. You persisted, even though I was sure all you were going to find was a dead end. I will never be able to repay you for what you've done for me. Finding an Aaron allowed me to bring that chapter of my life to a close. I feel free. A great weight has been lifted off my heart. This moment, it feels like the moment before the sunrise, when all the world is still, holding its breath, waiting for first light. I can stop thinking about my past and look forward to the future. Thank you, my friend. You will always have my gratitude. <laughs> 